I think this whole thing with Michelle and I is sort of like a, a jigsaw puzzle. Um, one afternoon, my auditor walked into my office and um, he said to me, do you want to have a good news story this afternoon? And the day was actually quite a bad day, so I said to him, yes, please tell me this good news story. And uh, he said, uh, Beth, do you know that there is this wall about a kilometer from where we're sitting right now and it's a, it's a wall with um, a kind of safe incubator that takes in babies. And I said, no, that can't be true. I've never heard of this. And he said, well, Stefania and I, that's his wife, are gonna go and check this out. And uh, that's exactly what happened. The next morning he came to me and he said, there is a wall. <laughs> and it is there and, and it says the Jessica wall of life. A week later, and well, before I say that, but for that whole week, I toyed on this idea and I was absolutely mesmerized by it. And I thought, you know, how is this possible? Um, can somebody actually do this? And a week later, my dog went missing. Um, and a week after that, a lady with the name of Michelle found my dog. But on my cell phone, I've got Michelle to this day as Michelle Buster. I don't know if you know that. <laughs> <laughs> and um, I picked Buster up and I introduced myself to Michelle and I gave her a hug and I said thank you so much for finding our dog. We never thought we'd ever find him. And um, a week after that, my sister phoned me and she said, "How? Who, phoned, who found Buster? And I said, well, a lady with the name of Michelle. And I said, yeah, she's in the police. She said, I know Michelle. Her name's Michelle Stevenson and she founded the Jessica Wall of Life. I said, no, that can't be. Well, anyway, I, I phoned you up and we made an appointment to have tea. And um, we present a course at, um, in our church, FFI. And I really felt a strong, I just felt I needed to invite this lady on this course. And um, I don't know for what reason. And I said, well, let me take her out for tea, give her a little gift to thank her and get to know Michelle because I knew once we met that we're going to walk this path together for a long time. I didn't know why, but I just knew it in my spirit. And we had a nice cup of tea and my jaw was hanging on the table because I thought, now I've got to ask this lady to come on this course and she just knows it all and she looks so together. <laughs> <laughs> looks a bit deceiving. <laughs> and I plucked up enough courage and I said to her, Michelle, I really loved having tea with you, but I really think you need to come on this course. And she just sort of looked at me and she said, I've really been wanting and I've been asking God for an opportunity like this. And that was it. Uh, we, you, I invited you. It just so happened that she was in a course, well, in a group with a whole lot of teenagers. And I knew this wouldn't worry you. The absolute, exactly. They loved having her. And that weekend, she met Ivan. On the family courses that we do, um, there's a specific time on the weekend that we do with the groups where we share with each person in the group the, the meaning of their names. Um, and I've done it for, for 15 years. And usually what I do is I look through the meaning of the names beforehand because we pray a Father's blessing prayer over each, each person. And uh, what happened was, is for some other reason, on that weekend I did not read through the names, which I wish I did. <laughs> because the moment I went around and um, I got on my knees to do this Father's blessing and read out Michelle's name, it just hit me like a ton of bricks. Uh, yeah, there's no other words for it. It hit me like a ton of bricks. And, um, and I immediately knew what God was saying over, over Michelle's life and about the whole story of Jessica's wall of life. Michelle's name means who is like God. And I just realized that, that through her life, that God is shouting out a message. Everywhere people are complaining about the abortion laws, but, but who is going to be like God and get their hands dirty and, and, and do something. And, and that, that's the message of hope and, and life coming through Jessica's wall of life and Jessica means gift from God and 
And she was a true gift. She lived a short while, but she's left a legacy and a message.